to our channel. Today we're going to be reading DreamWorks Boss Baby Back in Business, Puppy Park. Boss Baby was excited to start his day. He met with his field team. They needed help with a new project. Suddenly the baby spotted something. Adorable puppies. There was a puppy party in the park. I lost my team to puppies, Boss Baby said. A puppy came over to play with Boss Baby. It was not just any puppy, it was Bug the Pug. He worked for Puppy Co. They were not friends. But Puppy Co. had fired Bug the Pug. Now Bug the Pug wanted to get rid of Baby Corp. If people loved puppies more than babies, maybe he could get his job back. Boss Baby had to warn his team. No more cuddles, Boss Baby said. Boss Baby called Jimbo and Stacy for help. Meanwhile, the grown-ups were watching a puppy dance. Were they going to think puppies were cuter than babies? Boss Baby and Bug the Pug decided to have a contest. Whoever could take control of a dog collar would win. Boss Baby left Mega Baby in charge. Boss Baby and Bug the Pug both tried to get the collar. Soon they were both tired. They took a break. But there was a problem. Mega Baby had taken charge of the puppies. Now all of the puppies were after Boss Baby and Bug the Pug. Boss Baby and Bug the Pug had to work together to stop them. Bug the Pug would make Mega Baby angry. Maybe one of the grown-ups would see. Just then, a grown-up did. I'm very disappointed, she told her son, Mega Baby. It was not nice to be mean to puppies. Mega Baby went home. As for Boss Baby and Bug the Pug, they agreed to be nice to each other. Maybe now they could plan a real puppy party. Thank you for joining us for today's book read, DreamWorks Boss Baby Back in Business Puppy Party. We hope you guys enjoyed the book. Consider subscribing. If you're into these types of books, consider sharing this with your friends and family if they enjoy these types of books. And stay tuned for another book read coming soon. Take care, guys, and keep on reading. Goodbye. Bye.